Hello everybody, welcome to part 9 of the Ultimate MTG Unboxing Experience. This is almost the end of our big journey together. This is the ninth episode, then there's going to be a tenth episode, then the final episode in which we are going to uh, just recap what we have done, basically, take a look at all our cards in uh, the collection, and then I'm going to talk to you about the future project that you're going to see uh, here on my, ch my channel, uh, but I'm going to work on uh, the new year, this new year, 2022. It's going to be uh, an, an year full of surprises, full of great content, great duels, epic duels together. And I'm also going to uh, reveal my 10 favorite cards from Magic the Gathering. I'm going to rank them in a chart, and I'm going to tell you my favorite MTG card, like my number one from the whole of Magic the Gathering, from the entire game. Okay, so in this video, we are up against a bad boss, the big box over there. This is going to be the most challenging unboxing video that we have ever tackled so far and it's going to be a real challenge all right let's do this let's now take a look at the uh, details for this purchase and let's take a closer look at the big box of cards from germany so this box comes from germany the seller was shatwill one uh, of the most popular sellers on car market is a power seller he sells thousands of cards Check this out. This is the box. The, the script right there in German. All right. Okay. It's not too heavy. All right. It's not too heavy, but it, it's full of cards anyway. Okay, so here we've got the list. You see two pages. And I paid 27.32 euros for this big box. The shipping was 10 euros. Okay, let's now open the box. Boom! Very nice. This is the Deck Builders Toolkit. Pretty cool. Expand your collection instantly. Shadows over Innistrad. Let's slide this. Oh! Very nice. This is the first time that I've opened a box like this one. Oh, cool. Oh. These this have all been sleeved? Is this for real? You see this? They've all been sleeved. Check this out. Am I dreaming? You see that? Sleeves right there? They've all been sleeved. They all come pre-sleeved. Wow. I was really surprised when I opened the box from 
Arcana Trieste, and I found inside the box some cards pre-sleeved. Here we've got a whole bunch of cards here, right here. And they've all been already sleeved. And wow, this is a dream. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I was running out of sleeves actually. And here the cards already have their sleeves on. This is incredible. This is great. Check this out. Another package right here. And all the cards sleeved. This is surreal. Wow, what a gift. This is my gift for Christmas. <laughs> Thank you, Shadwell. Thank you very much. Really appreciate this. Very nice. Very nice. And these nice plastic bags. Oh my. This here we are really one step above the standard. Okay. Here we've got what is this? It's a brand new booklet with all the rules to play the game, I think. Yes. Okay. We've got two copies. Oh, this was Innistrad. Check this out. I didn't purchase all this stuff, huh? This is why I'm so surprised. Okay, here we got a um, pretty cool... Um, I don't know how to call this. This is a, I don't know, presentation paper for this set, for Innistrad. How to build a deck with some information for new players, probably. Oh, check this out. Pretty cool. Nice. Innistrad. The five colors. Okay. Pretty cool. This could actually be a nice poster also here for my for my room. Okay, so let me now tidy up everything. Here we got um you see a lot of stuff here that we just have to sort out. And one thing I want to make this clear, I didn't purchase all this stuff, okay? So uh, the box here, basically, uh, it's a free giveaway from this seller. Just like all these, uh, you see, all this stuff here, and that nice poster. And the cards, they all come pre-sleeved, and I didn't buy them pre-sleeved. So here, there's a great service towards the customer, and this is just excellency, okay? And I don't know what to say, you also... Uh, we're able to see the box. The box that we opened before was uh, very tight and very well sealed. Um, I'm really surprised here. I am very surprised, but very, very surprised. Okay, it's great, uh, great quality here. And all right, so it turns out that we just have these two sets of cards that we're gonna have to take a look at. So, actually I was a bit scared, but, you know, uh, there's still a lot of cards here that we have to take a look at. Uh, I thought there were more, but it looks like we'll be able to make it in less than half an hour, probably. Okay, let me now place these two sets here on the side. Okay, and there we have it. The MTG box tower is ready. Okay, I think we are ready. Okay, I have opened the first set and there's a lot of cards that we have to take a look at. I'm going to bring them now here onto the slider. We're going to take a close look at them. And there's just one thing that I like to say. In this video, I'm going to try something new. I'm going to cut the uh, transitions from one card to another. So you're just going to see the cards already positioned on the slider and that should help us speed things up for this video and just make this video shorter, okay? And we're going to start here with the first set of cards 
and we're going to take a look at a bunch of goblins. Two copies of Goblin War Paint, one Goblin War Chief, Goblin Oriflame, Hellraiser Goblin, Goblin Slide, and two copies of Goblin Race Runners. Goblin Hellcutter, Goblin Goon, Free Headed Goblin, Volley Veteran, two copies of Zurta Goblin, and two copies. Goblin Smuggler Goblin War Party Siege Gang Commander Box of Free Range Goblins Four Goblin Tokens The last two Goblins Tuk Tuk the Explorer and Goblin Electromancer. Three copies of Typhoid Rats. Three Scarecrow Creatures Harvest Hand turns into Scrounged Scythe Two copies of Steadfast Cathar and one copy of Light Wielder Paladin Knight of the Tusk, Benelish Marshal, and Champion of the Parish. Veteran Cathar, Tusk Guard Captain, and Relentless Hunter. Emancipation Angel, Patron of the Valiant, and a very nice copy of Sephara's Sephara Sky's Blade. Two copies of Undercity Troll, and one copy of Warden of the Woods. One copy of Contraband Kingpin, one copy of Ascended Law Mage, and one copy of Staunch Shieldmate. Soul of Innistrad. Dracosef. Maw of Flames. This card is breathtaking. Beautiful card. One copy of Drawn from Dreams. Two copies of Retreat to Kazandu. And one copy of Yavimaya Coast. A bunch of artifacts. Cathar's Shield. Sacred Armory. 
chief of the foundry and the witch's cauldron. To end this first set, we have a series of creature tokens, three spirits, four spirits, followed by four wolves. Also for the second set, we're going to start with some goblins. And let me place here on the slider Tuk Tuk Grunts and two copies of Wandering Goblins. Two copies of Goblin Short Cutter, followed by two copies of Foundry Street Denizen. Up next, we've got four copies of Goblin Tunneler. Goblin Chariot. Goblin Death Raiders. And Goblin Outlander. Goblin Battle Jester. Ramaging Goblin, Goblin Sky Raider, and the final card is Blood Crazed Goblin. We're gonna start here with two boars Blade Tusk Boar and Boar Umbra. Four copies of Rune Claw Bear. Very cool bear, this one. The artwork is really nice. Two copies of Ulvenwald Bear. Bunch of Wolves. Two copies of Sacred Wolf. And one copy of Ulvenwald Mystics, which turns into. Umberwald Primordials. Let's now check out a bunch of flying creatures. Here we got Shepherd of the Lost and Gold Knight Redeemer. These are the only two angel creatures in this set. Then here we got Cloud Crusader and Assault Griffin. Nepharox, Overlord of Grixis. Xafrid, Necromancer and Grave Digger. Here we got two copies of Midnight Guard. Midnight Guardo. And two copies of Dawn Strike Paladin. War Priest of Fune, Fiend Hunter, and Geist Honored Monk. Palace Guard, Palace Guardo, <laughs> Veteran Armorer, and Fraben Valiant. I keep saying Guardo. Uh, because that is in Japanese. Palazzo Gardo. <laughs> we got some knights coming up next. Two copies of Benalish Lancer. Lionheart Maverick. And Paladin of Pra. We end this series with Paragon. Of Fierce Defiance, Paragon of Eternal Wilds, and this wall creature here is his Ageless Sentinels. 
three copies of Vortex Elemental. This is a very nice card. I really like the artwork here. The C is always hungry. Two artifact equipment, Vanguard's, Vanguard's Shield and Pennon Blade. Triplicate Spirits and Glimpse the Sun God. And the last two cards of the set with a very stunning artwork. These are like opposite cards. Holy Strength and Unholy Strength. Check out these cards. These two cards are just two masterpieces. They are beautiful. Beautiful to behold. Very nice illustrations. You see the sword here turn upright, and here instead the sword that is pointing downwards. Very cool. Choose your sign white or black. You're going to fight for justice, or you're going to fight for power. Join the dark side of the force. You're gonna be bestowed with unparalleled unholy strength. Very nice. I really like these two cards. I'm just going to place them side by side on my binder so that I can compare them. Okay, this is everything, everybody. We have already made it. This was actually pretty easy. You see here with these new techniques that we have developed uh, it was actually pretty pretty simple it looked very daunting at the beginning but it was actually pretty simple okay so i'm really happy here because I'm, i see that i'm making progress with these unboxing videos i have gained the confidence that i that i needed that i wanted to have that i wanted to develop and i feel more confident now i feel more comfortable when i have to speak here to the camera and i have to comment the ca on the cards for the first time and with this new device also the mtg box tower i have also come up with a new system to showcase cards uh, without having to worry about the camera losing focus on the card so you see here this might sound pretty a pretty stupid project this whole mtg unboxing experience but it's actually very formative and we really take a look at some very nice artwork together and i think that's something that values right all right thank you for uh, following me and thank you for uh, watching this video now i have to leave you i'm gonna have to edit this video and then i'm going to upload it on my channel we're going to see each other in the next episode in the next episode, that is going to be the final chapter of this long journey. We're going to take a look at, an, at that box right there uh, from Dracarys Viterbo. And that's going to be the final set of cards that we're going to unbox for this big journey. Okay, so bye-bye everybody. Have a good day.